Alright, g'day guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how to start a fire with Alright, g'day guys. Today I'm going to sh be showing you how to start a fire with one of these. So what you need, you just want to grab a whole cup of dry grass because it works really well with getting, this fire, getting the fire going. So, you want to grab like a decent amount because it's more of a So you want to pull a hole and ditch it. The burst has a hole in it. Then you want to grab some dry, dry leaves. I prefer to use dry thin leaves, they're thinner the better because it just gets the fire stuck. Fire but like the stuff gets going straight away. So you scrunch it up until it's like a little bit. Put it in the hole. You want to make sure there's enough in there so it gets your fire going. Focus the beam right to the front of the leaves of them. Onto your leaves. So it's already smoking. Now you want to burn enough of this on that's the ember. And that is what's going to get fire going. This is the ember will burn all your dead grass. That will get fire going. Still smoking as it is now. You want to get it, get it like this, and blow it. There we go. See how thick it is getting? Now put it in your fire pit and start blowing. It's just getting thicker and thicker. Now just keep blowing until it bursts into flames. There we go. Oh, jeez. And you will get it in your mouth, but hey, this is the way it is. And then you start adding your sticks. Alright, it might go out, but you're just going to keep going. Now that will just burn to your sticks and voila, you got fire. Just make sure you grab some leaves, doesn't matter what leaves, to keep your fire going. You gotta keep getting cranked. You gotta, you gotta fuel. See how it goes. I'll just see how it go. I'll just see how it goes, and then yeah, it's just smoking. But it, it definitely works. If you know what you're doing, it works. You just gotta get enough of the grass and put enough leaves in the middle, and then get that magnifying glass over, and then you get a flame. But nothing's happening right now.
The leaves just, the leaves will fuel it, so. Yeah, just, where do you see a little flame put leaves, so it just keeps it going. It keeps it going. I think the sticks are too thick. I should have got to the sticks. Oh, there we go. It's working. It'll get there. Like, this is like just like a primitive way to start a fight. If you want to be, if you don't want to use matches or a lighter, you should be more primitive. This is the way to go. Although, one of these isn't primitive. You can, it's just more primitive than a lighter or a match. There are more primitive ways, but this is probably the more, this is probably like an, an easy way to get it going. See now the fire's starting to pick up. So, all right, guys, this is just one of my first videos outdoors. I'm gonna film lots of videos around here. This, this is like my outdoor kitchen. I might do us like a separate tour with this with my kitchen. I just gotta like do it up. Is it, all it is is just a five pivot logs to see on. Oh thank you, Wind. Get my fire crank. Thank you. Thank you. Alright there, the fire that, that's a healthy fire, that'll burn for a while. Just add more leaves. That should keep it fuel. That's burning. Alright guys, I'm gonna be filming I'm gonna be filming lots of catch and cooks and other stuff. So stay tuned. I'm gonna film like yabby and crabbing because that's what we're planning to do. Because we do we do we, we went crabbing last night but Unfortunately, we didn't get enough, so I couldn't film catch and cook. Oh, Jesus. Alright, there we go. So, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Alright, guys, today I'm going to be blue swimmer crabbing at last.